Do you know the difference between an LLC and an S-Corp? Most people don't, and it's a pretty important distinction to make, especially when it comes to your taxes. I'm Marissa from Collective, the formation, tax, and accounting solution for self-employed people. In this video, I'm going to break down the difference between an LLC and an S-Corp so you can make the best choice for your business. Let's start with the basics. An LLC and an S-Corp actually aren't opposing options. They work together to provide legal and tax benefits for your business. An LLC, or a limited liability company, is a legal structure for your business that separates your personal and business assets, protecting your personal assets from business liabilities and lawsuits. An S-Corp, or S-Corporation, is a tax selection, not a legal structure. That means that you can be an LLC and an S-Corp at the same time. When we say LLC versus S-Corp, we're really talking about how your LLC is taxed. A single member LLC will be taxed like a sole proprietorship. That's the same tax treatment you'd get if you hadn't organized as an LLC. And it has some drawbacks like self-employment tax. Self-employment tax is 15.3% and goes towards your social security and Medicare. You'll pay it on most of your business profits. And as you can imagine, that can add up pretty fast. To lighten your tax load, you can ask the IRS to tax your LLC as an S-Corp. With an S-Corp taxation, you don't pay self-employment tax on your profits. Instead, you pay yourself, yes, you the owner of the business, a reasonable compensation via payroll. In other words, you're going to be getting a salary from your business and your salary becomes a tax deductible business expense. Your S-Corp salary is subject to payroll taxes, which are 15.3%. Yep, just like self-employment tax. Your business will pay for half of those taxes and you'll pay the other half personally. The profits from your S-Corp are not subject to that 15.3% tax, just your salary. This is where the potential tax savings come in. Your salary doesn't have to be the same amount as your profits. It just needs to be reasonable for what you do. So if you had a $160,000 in profit and paid yourself $60,000 as an S-Corp owner, this is what the tax difference would be. Keep in mind, this is an estimate and a simplified calculation, but you get the point. The biggest difference between an LLC and S-Corp is how you're taxed, but there are a few other differences to know. An S-Corp has to file a separate federal business tax return, which you don't have to do as an LLC. Also, S-Corp shareholders must be US citizens or permanent residents, while anyone can be a member of an LLC. With both an LLC and an S-Corp, you'll still file a personal income tax return and pay income taxes on the profits of the business. And with both, you may need to pay quarterly estimated taxes. Choosing between an S-Corp and an LLC comes down to your individual circumstances. If you're making a lot of self-employed income, electing S-Corp taxation could help you cut the cost of self-employment tax significantly. But if you're just starting out, an LLC might be the way to go. I hope this video helped you understand the difference between an S-Corp and an LLC and which one might be right for your business. If you need more help setting up your LLC and S-Corp, go to collective.com and learn how we can help you with your business formation, taxes, accounting, and bookkeeping. And if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, and subscribe below, and be sure to check out the additional resources linked in the description. Thanks for watching.